In batch type pan evaporator, the product is either heated in a steam jacketed vessel, as uh, shown in this uh, photograph, uh, where we have steam that is fed into an outside jacket around the vessel, or the product is heated in a vessel that contains steam coils. A steam will then condense inside the coils and the heat will be transferred into the liquid food. Typically the vessel is open to the atmosphere or it may be connected to vacuum as we see here in this animation. Vacuum is used to boil the liquid at a temperature below its boiling point. This allows concentrating products that are heat sensitive. Also as we see in this animation as the steam condenses in the uh, outside jacket it leaves as a condensate and once the product has concentrated to the required concentration values it is then discharged. We notice that the heat transfer area is quite small. The heating of product is by natural convection. That means that the residence time, that is the time that the liquid food spends inside the vessel, is rather long. And therefore, the processing capacity in these types of evaporators is also low. Sometimes paddles may be used inside the vessel for agitation to improve the rate of heat transfer. Also when coils are used sometimes they may be rotated inside the vessel again to increase the rate of heat transfer.